Hello guys, this is a high demand. Uh, someone asked me if I can cook something calderita substitution. So we are making topo rita. So it's a topo stew. And this is what our ingredients. We have one fourth cup of peas. And uh, that's about a teaspoon of um, ginger. It's um, chunk. And one cloves of garlic and onion and we have our vegetable um, bouillon and tomato paste and one potato and half a cup of carrots and one chayote squash all right let's start so we're gonna cut this into cubes so in here guys i cut this into cubes as you can see that and i got this tofu firm so Usually, I would fry this and then put, you know, flour and all that stuff. So, I'm trying to intend to make this for also for the people who do keto diet. Alright, so, in here, in my hand pan, it's already on. So, I'm going to put just a tablespoon of oil. Alright, and then start our carrots. You'll be surprised. My, my squash here and my potato already I cheated I put this on the um, microwave and pre cook them so everything's gonna go to really really fast here all right so from here we're gonna put our tofu let's brown that a little bit so while the tofu is cooking so I'm gonna put our vegetable seasoning here so if you are not really vegetarian and you want to use chicken or a beef broth uh, or beef you know bouillon you can and um, I'm gonna mix this up too right here to make the paste it's gonna be overflowing so now we're gonna put our ginger Now we know our tofu, our main ingredient is hot. Alright. So from here, we're going to put our garlic. And some of the onion. And then we'll cover it up. Okay, so in here... I diluted the uh, all that um, tomato paste, uh, vegetable bouillon, and also our goya. So you need one package of goya. So some of that, half of it, I put on the, uh, the water. So half of this, I'm gonna sprinkle it with the tofu. Okay, start to be color, right? All right, so now, we're going to pour in everything in there. And of course, we're going to pour about a teaspoon of soy. It looks like salburita, you guys. And this is, you know, the other way you enjoy your tofu or tokwa. So now we pour in our sauce. And look at that sauce. This is very, very rich. And we'll let it cover for five minutes and it should be done really soon here all right guys so time to turn it off turn off that and look what it looks like look like calderita except this is toporita topo stew and there you have it you guys and we'll do a little touch up and a little bit of olive oil 
because you know we have no meat that's just tofu but this is what it looks like tofu stew toporita here you go delicious